वेलकम टू लावण्यास कंप्यूटर क्लासेस इन दिस वीडियो वी विल एक्सप्लेन थ्री लेवल आर्किटेक्चर इन डीबीएमएस सो व्हाट इज द थ्री लेवल आर्किटेक्चर सो दिस इज दिस इज द डायग्राम फॉर थ्री लेवल आर्किटेक्चर सो फर्स्ट विल गो फॉर व्हाट इज द थ्री लेवल्स व्हाट आर द नेम्स ऑफ द थ्री लेवल्स मींस फर्स्ट लेवल इज फिजिकल लेवल फिजिकल लेवल आर्किटेक्चर और फिजिकल स्कीमा सेकंड वन इज लॉजिकल लेवल लॉजिकल स्कीमा थर्ड वन इज व्यू लेवल व्यू स्कीमा so physical level is also known as internal level logical level is also known as conceptual level view level is known as external level so this is the names for three level architecture so here this is the diagram first database database means as a collection of data and here users are there users are using this database depends upon the their requirement that's why external view is number of view this is also called as view level also so these users are using the database but this entire database for protecting your entire database that's why we requiring three levels so users are using the database but they don't know how it is stored where it is stored just they are using the database only that's why it is protecting the database they abstract the database but total implementation is hide from the users so this is the three level of architecture so before going the three level of architecture first we know what is the schema schema what is schema means it is a structure of database skeleton of the database how the data is stored in which format the data is stored that is entire thing is explained using schema for example i have database like 1a and 18 so this is the data so what one indicates one indicates the serial number a indicates name of the student 18 indicates a student age so it if uh, the data is stored in this format that is called as schema what is the name of the table for the, we need one name for the table so the table name is student student is the name of the table so what are the fields are there serial number yes name age so these are the fields that means one is stored in serial number a is stored in student name 18 is stored in age so this is the structure of the student so what is the syntax means table name field 1 field 2 so on okay. how many fields you want keep all the fields in this so this is the structure of this table and also it explains what are the primary key what is the relation between one field to another field everything is explained that is known as schema so after that there are three schema architecture is there that is also called as three level architecture the main pur purpose of this architecture is protecting your database hide from the user so implementation so one is the physical level or physical schema logical level or logical schema or conceptual schema third one is view level view schema or external schema okay in this physical level it totally concentrate on how the database is stored how the data is stored where the data is stored it describes the physical storage structure of the data it is mostly concentrate on storage devices only where it is stored all about the storage areas physical data be totally concentrate on the storage devices only where it is stored it describes the physical storage structure everything physically second one is logical level this logical level is also known as conceptual level in this it explain the structure of the whole database what is the structure of the database what are the fields are there what are the entities are there what is the data types what is the relationship between one entity to another entity or relationship between field to field any constraints are there key constraints primary key constraints everything is explained in the conceptual level so in the conceptual level what type of data we are store next in view level view level is also known as uh, users level external level depends upon the users requirements so they will see the information that's why view levels are more so in the physical level we concentrate on how the data is stored 
where the data is stored in logical level what type of data is stored so this is everything is known as three level architecture three level architecture depends upon this we go for physical data in data independence also the main concept of this three level architecture is data independence thank you for watching my video if you like this video subscribe my channel like it share it thank you